Hi, I've just installed VirtualBox and I'm having problems loading up the machine itself and installing the uh, Ubuntu uh, image file and it presented me with this error. Now I'm going to show you how to fix this. It's because in your BIOS um, you don't have virtualization enabled probably. So I'm going to switch to my iPhone and film how I've done it on my phone and then switch back and see if it solved the problem. So let's switch over to the iPhone footage. Right, so now we are in the BIOS settings um, and if we go down to the bottom here, bottom right, it will say advanced mode. And then when in advanced, there's all of these um, tabs across the top. We need to be going to advanced. And then um, in advanced, there will be a CPU configuration up here at the top. And if we scroll down, it will say whether or not um, it's supported, which if you can see there, and there it says mine's supported but if you scroll down this is where you enable and disable them here so as you can see there Intel virtualization technology and mine is disabled at the minute so I'm going to enable that and now hopefully after boot we should be ready to go so now we exit easy mode save and exit and there we go it's telling us now that uh, it was disabled and now it's enabled and press OK and now we should boot back up and there we go it's now booting back up and I'll switch back to uh, my screen capture Right now we're back in Windows and we have launched up the VirtualBox Manager. Um, one thing to note um, before you start, um, you need to select which operating system because just uh, a second ago I had it on to 32 bit where my ISO file is uh, 64 bit and it wasn't launching and I didn't. It is producing an error, um, and this is where you find it. It's in the settings, um, basic, general. Um, you set that to 64 bit and you apply that, um, and it will say up there 64 bit. Um, and we'll give this a go. We'll press start. And we added that, that was our um, you choose disk image, didn't we? And we put Exabunto 64 and there we are it's now reading the file sorry the disk image as it would do if you were to put it into your machine a blank card drive and it's brought up the installer and that is how you install um, Um, a, a virtual machine and fix that problem that we had um, with um, the BIOS not having virtualization enabled. Um, so that's the end of this tutorial and I'll uh, see you next time.